quarter to two in the afternoon and we're gonna take off and do a little running but it's not even 60 degrees outside and it's June 15th unbelievable all right we're gonna huh yeah I know but you're like that in the middle of winter <laughs> it's cold this is ridiculous all right we're gonna do some running and we're gonna take my car yeah, I wish I had some, tell you the truth. <laughs> so we're hitting marks for a little bit of shopping. We hit the bank already. And then we got to hit uh, Giant Eagle real quick. All right, we got the shopping done at Mark's, but this is the funny part. Watch Rich trying to get into my car. He can barely get into this thing. <laughs> oh, no. I gotta get in this way first. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, my phone down. Oh, this car is too small. It's Reaper. Ow. Oh, oh my God. I can't see. I can't get my head in that sitting down. <laughs> right. I can't get in. Ow. 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 That hurts me. Ow. He made it. <laughs> All right, so we're back from the store, only to, uh, <laughs> and I showed Rich a picture, Dawn, uh, working with Marks to get us those plans flats. We haven't got them yet, but she did surprise Rich. And he's been wanting some spiral bushes for some time now. I'd say, I don't know, last six years or so, we've been looking at them, and uh, Dawn got him a couple for free. Only problem, four of them actually, and we got them a trumpet tree that's about three foot high now. Only problem is, is I gotta come all the way out here, get his van keys, go all the way to my house, get the tree, and bring them all the way back. They will not Jump fit. the van and then take his car all the way back home. <laughs> yeah, so that's I got about- Four one hour trips today. Yeah, <laughs> so I'm gonna run home and go get those and bring them back to Old Fire, so you guys stay tuned. Dan was here and he mowed the grass the other day and he used his machine. Uh, I had my car parked behind the bus and I still ended up with a car full of weeds. And guess what? <laughs> his van's the same way. Grass everywhere. All right, I'm gonna head down to my house and grab these trees for Rich. All right, I made it back to my place. And, you know, just look around a little bit. Some of Dawn's plants. And she has out here and uh, you know she works with Sue at where she works at Mark's and gets a lot of sickly plants and this and that takes care of them plants them and does her thing and you know so forth so on so these are the four trees that we're gonna give rich they need a little work but for free not a problem and then they, uh, Dawn's had her angel trumpet you guys seen that bloom several times and about a year or so ago, we started a branch, and we got one going for Big Rich. So it's already got two stems growing on it. So uh, it'll do really good. And within probably two, three years, it'll start producing some flowers. And then you guys won't believe this, but this was years ago, probably four, maybe five, I got Dawn, you know, her poinsettias for Christmas, like we always do. This is a poinsettia plant. There's three of them in there. No, it's just one. No, oh, it I is? Okay. I've been braiding them okay. since it was but uh, that's one and that sucker's almost up to my chest now so it's about four foot high but how many people got a point center like that and it does bloom the red flowers during Christmas so awesome but in the meantime uh, that's another dogwood tree I don't know if he wants that or not <laughs> you've seen you know what happened it, it, that's where the snow is it's dogwood seeds and we knew that but uh, everybody had chime in on it but no big deal we knew that but uh, I don't know if he wants another dogwood tree or not in the backyard. I'll ask him. Take it uh, and give it away to somebody. Yeah, because we don't want it, really, right? So I got enough trees. Yeah, we, got, we do. We got enough trees. And uh, actually, he's losing a tree down there and, and so forth. So I'll take it with me. If he doesn't want it, we'll give it away to somebody. But we're going to load this up into the OFR van, and <laughs> I'm going to go back to OFR again. So it's been a back and forth kind of a situation. This stuff, I'm gonna check out, it's ground covering. Climbs on rocks and so forth. So I'm gonna do a little investigating on it <clears throat> and see if that might work out uh, around, 
you know, pond a little bit. Instead of getting all the weeds, we could plant this around and keep it out. I don't know. I'll have to check it out. But in the meantime, we're going to get this loaded up, me and Don, and get this stuff back to OFR so we can make another video. What a mess. But we got to get this all cleaned up because we are going to Connecticut. That is for sure. We do have a trip. We'll probably rent a U-Haul on that one. I'll tell you guys more about that in a minute. All right. You guys stay tuned. All right, Don and I got everything loaded. We're going to take that anyways, taking that anyways. We'll, do, we'll figure something out. We'll give it away, whatever. But, yep, because we don't need it here. And uh, hopefully within a day or so, maybe next week, we'll have three, four flats we can take down to uh, OFR and plant them up like where the uh, blood grass was that died off. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, made it back to OFR. And uh, I'll go ahead and get rich, and uh, maybe I can get... Uh, Jerry or Patty or whatever, give me a hand, we'll get these uh, bushes out and put them somewhere for now. I have no idea where he wants them. <laughs> oh, wow. That's a dogwood tree. What is a dogwood? Well, you know all the snow that's been coming? Okay. That's, a, that's from the dogwood tree. So I guess you got a lot of them out the there. Dogwood tree does snow. What are you talking about? Oh, this this uh, right. Okay. The seeds that've been coming down. Right, it's from a dogwood. That's a ground covering, and it might do well on rocks. I gotta look at it. But again, we have no use for any of this stuff. So okay. it's like even if we don't want it, we can give it to somebody or something. But I know you wanted them trees. You've been looking for them. Yeah, they're nice. They need to grow a little bit, but we can you know work with them for free. Can't beat it. All right, we're going to carry these in the back. Right here, going too high. Right there. This is this one's big enough. Nope. Yeah. All right. Kathy. Kathy. Hey, Kathy. No. Ah, she left. You were going to mess with her. Well, I was going to tell her. This, this is where her... Oh, okay. A bed, and I was going to start here and bring it this way, and then go straight down that side of the tree and make this her raised garden bed. She's got trees, shrubs, and she can get rid of all this grass and do all of her planting and her flowers and everything right here. Okay. Oh, so these things when here, did you move the mats? What's you that? finally got the mats moved. The mats? The bridge mats. Oh, yeah, I stacked them over there. When did you do that? And mowed all that. Come on over here and look at this. Yeah, this is... Damn, it's only been a day. We get stuff done, son. <laughs> okay, so that's all picked up from there. Then well, I mowed so. over it. We ran a brand new, remember that cable that was yeah. up on the back deck, 150 foot long? Right. We ran one, a brand new one to the, the river. It's running over, filling the pond. And then uh, we needed all this, all that weeds off that edge of that hillside right there. Right. Got all that ran out of the, the so you can see where it stopped up there. Right. Right here. So now we've, we've got that new cable on there. We need to order in more dirt so that I can make this flat from that tree to here and then that tree that way, like this land is. Right. And push more over the edge and make that nice and, and neater, more smooth of an edge. And then fill in down there to where it's not so far down. Um, and then see how this dips down here? We'll make this nice and level all the way down. And, uh, and you got to keep that one pathway in order to get across, so. Right. There's like mm. a high point in the dirt here. We can take that and level that down. It makes this whole backyard nice and smooth. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, and then the burn there. pile's gone. I, I emptied the rest <laughs> of that trailer over there. Yep, no more burn pile. So uh, when uh, one of the community service guys come over next, I've got that DR mower you put that cable on. That's going to do good. We'll get the rest of these weeds off the top of here. Take it across, do all the weeds around that whole berm of that the that, uh, uh, pond yeah. back there, yeah. yeah. And then our, we'll be done with getting our, our backyard ready for spring. <laughs> <laughs> and now yeah. we start over here. We're going to lay down some more flat rock there, and we're going to start building our fire pit right here. So we can have like four or five chairs right here. Now that'll be a feature on this side of the deck. You got your tables there, and you got the hammock over there. Which now I've got Wi-Fi out here. I rearranged all the Wi-Fi things. Oh, really? I was laying in that hammock the day before yesterday and had Wi-Fi out here. 
Really? Officer Tracy on the hammock laying there. I know, because sometimes they'll sit at the end of the table, and then i got to get up and go inside yeah. because yeah, I'm not no. connecting or it's not, you know. And now it's warm enough. See so all these rocks here? Them are there to spell out Tracy's name in right. the deep end over there. We can get that done to where now we can weed eat up to the rocks and get all this taken care of. Mm-hmm. But we do need more. See these lily pads? I know. I want them to go all the way around this whole edge to where the birds, you know, the big herrings don't come down and step in there. Right. So we need to fill in these gaps. So like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. It's so like another 16 or 18. Right. I don't know pads. how. That one used to be over here or there, and it got knocked down. It's actually on the bottom, dude. Yeah. So... So is this one yeah, so is that one there. And uh, I'm going to go over there because you, you see what that is over by that log? Yeah. <laughs> go get it. Yeah, it's that <laughs> stupid primrose. Forget that. I'm going to go get that out of there now. <laughs> so, uh, oh, yeah, there it is, a trumpet plant. So uh, the one thing we do have to do is uh, transplant the trumpet plant into a bigger pot. Okay. Uh, we but, have bigger pots. Yeah, Ryan, Dawn was running out a few we had, and I'm like, oh, we got a bunch. And she was running out of dirt and said, you got more dirt than she's done. So. <laughs> but this stuff, I'm going to check it out. This stuff might do really good growing on the rocks and stuff. I don't know. You got to check that out. Nice ground covering. You can see how uh, rigid and sturdy yeah. it is. It almost reminds me of like a jade. So I'm going to check that out. All right. <laughs> Not a whole lot. It was raining most of the day this and that, but we did what we could and you know, ran out and got those plants and everything, so, uh, you know, take a look at the pond real quick, and then I'm out of here. Yeah. You can really see them paddlefish, though, man. All right, I got that, yep. <laughs> awesome. I love when they jump. All right, everybody. Yeah, I know she grabbed some of the eggs, so we're going to keep an eye on them. All right, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, so, you know, just a little running around here and there. We do got a big trip, like I said, in Connecticut. Mike Wynn, he was my first stop in Connecticut when we did that New York run where, you know, we had a little difficulty and I spent a couple extra days. But in the meantime, uh, we're gonna, you know, you know, got a couple other things. I'm out of here for the weekend. Uh, but Saturday's video, uh, Will Star came out a week or so ago, made a video, and he knew I was going on vacation and, you know, thought, hey, I'll help you out. It's awesome. So check it out. It'll be this Saturday of one of Will Star's. So, uh, you guys stay fishy, my friends. Hit that like, subscribe, and share. And we'll go deeper with the Reaper.